had a, a question of, of whether or not I may need an attorney. I had I was um, rearing in my um, vehicle probably about ten weeks ago, and the um, and the person that hit me, they took off. But I did take a picture of their vehicle, and uh, they did come out and compensate me for the damage to my my vehicle. Um, but you know, the doctor's telling me that I have to have the surgery. I'm gonna have to be down for four months and stuff. And you know, I'm a bachelor, and I just I don't know what to do. And I'm just wondering if it's the time to hire a lawyer or not. Now, when you said you took a picture of the vehicle, did the other did the other vehicle the, that person helped pay some money towards you? Is that what you're saying? Uh, well, when I took a picture of the, of the license plate of the vehicle that hit me because they had left the scene. Okay. And. Um, yeah, you know, um, evidently, you know, when I did that, you know, the police had located them faster. Okay. But my report was finished, so. Huh. That's uh, a crime, isn't it? To... Yeah, so they went on the report, and yeah. they, um, you know, they did compensate me for the damage to my vehicle because sure. I had blown both airbags and some other stuff. Right. Good. And yeah. I, yeah, but I have, uh, I guess I have a, a, a torn rotor cup and shoulder impingement and something like that. Okay. Well, Will, let's let um, Kirby talk to you a little bit and g give you some information that might help you. I tell you, when I hear Will's situation, I, I immediately go to uh, UM coverage because Will's got a very serious injury. If you're going to have to undergo surgery, it sounds like it was a, uh, a tremendous impact. Chances of the uh, liability insurance com company, the insurance for the person that hit you, having sufficient limits to take care of all your injuries and damages will are, are somewhat unlikely. And you will probably have to turn to your own insurance and file an underinsured motorist claim. Uh, you probably have health care insurance, so you're going to have to deal with something called subrogation, where your health insurance company gets paid back some of what it's paid on your behalf. So you've got what well, seems like a simple case, but a lot of complications. And, and I would think that uh, as, as serious as your injuries are, that you probably do need to see a lawyer.